Of the millions of toys that will be rung up, wrapped up, and given to children this holiday season, very few are made with kids like little Abigail Anderson in mind. As a baby, Abigail suffered seizures, which left her developmentally delayed and unable to play with the toys built for other four-year-olds. She needs toys that uh, are kind of well suited for her, that react a certain way, that um, are easier for her to manipulate, um, that teach her lots of cause and effect and that kind of thing. Abigail and other special needs children often need toys that are modified, like this one. It has a large on-off switch that she can find and work easily. But toys like these are almost impossible to find, which is why Abigail comes here. Hi. This is the Toy and Technology Library at Ohio State University Medical Center, one of only a handful in the country. Here, kids like Abigail can find toys that are just right for them. Most of the switch activated items and the specially adapted toys you can't buy locally. You have to order from catalogs and they're costly. For example, a toy like this in a store might only cost $10, but this one, modified for special needs kids, is nearly $50. But here, they're free. Just like books at a library, families here can come check out toys and even specialized computers to take home and try out. Uh, this is really leveling the playing field and just adapting uh, a device or a computer or a toy that every other other child uses uh, and just modifying it slightly so that they can enjoy it fully. Best of all, they choose their toys under the watchful eye of a therapist who not only finds toys kids will enjoy, but will learn from, which means both kids and parents always leave happy. At Ohio State University Medical Center, this is Clark Powell reporting.